Yo, what's up, Freeze Army, and welcome to another Fiber Wire special. This is set in Sapienza, so that's killing all the targets with the Fiber Wire only. Also, I'm going to do it in suit only and with no knockouts. So, I'm going to start in the main entrance, and I am going to have the emetic poison stored in my inventory in the uh, safe house. I'm sorry, and we'll be carrying our coins and just the Fiber Wire itself. Now, I'm going to be poisoning. Uh, Silvio Caruso's uh, pasta bolognese, but you may be thinking, uh, why have you added your emetic poison to your uh, safe house when you could have used the rat poison that's just in the kitchen and started in your safe house? The truth is, I completely forgot at the time there was rat poison in the kitchen, and by the time I was setting this record, I just remembered that I was at the main entrance rather than the safe house, so I continued to go along with it anyway, and these are the uh, chain of events that actually happened. So, I'm going to be going in the kitchen and I'm going to be crouching down and turning on the radio and then immediately scurrying around the side of the desk as you see the rat poison right there. But as soon as he goes off, we can go ahead and poison this to pass the bolognese with the, uh, the vomitor roll poison, the immediate poison right there. And we're going to crouch right out the door, wait for that guard to stop turning right. So we look, his head turns to the left, there you go, and we can ring the bell. And once, that rings, once we ring the bell, Silvio Caruso, Silvio Caruso, sorry, is going to be heading his this way now to uh, sample some of that tasty bolognese. We're going to shoot out that camera there and just run across the square through the window. We're going to head to Francesca now while that uh, chain of events happens with the food and being poisoned and all that stuff. So in the meantime, we can go ahead and take out Francesca with the fiber wire. So as we go up the top of the stairs, we're going to climb up the pipe and across the roof. And that's when we're going to get into Francesca's office room. And we're going to take an opportunity when uh, the guard has his back turned to take her out. There's a crate conveniently placed just behind us. So that makes it perfect for this run. Sapienza has definitely been the easiest one to do this challenge in. I think uh, Marrakesh might be... Um, well, it's not going to be too tough, I don't think. We'll also try and be covering the bonus episodes as well. It's kind of a forgotten uh, thing now. I don't see many things being covered in the bonus episodes now these days. Now once people have gotten over the hype of the, the first week and played it all to death, then people don't tend to uh, play those games anymore. But uh, I will be doing those bonus episodes as well, if you guys actually want to see that. So I will be doing that. We'll be doing Marrakesh. And I've already done Bangkok, so I won't be doing that one. I'm not going to do the training uh, facility either, because I think it's they're too easy. I don't think you'd want to see that anyway. So at the moment, just waiting for Tra Francesca to turn around. But uh, usually, this is the point where I just fast forward through the video. But um, I just wanted to get that bit of information across, so that's why I took the opportunity to say it now. So once uh, the guard has turned around and made it run, uh, in that you can see that from the mini map of where he walks to the other side of the room. That's when we took our opportunity and uh, fiber wired her. We're also going to pick up the key card that she drops as well. And now we can run all the way down to the bottom of the stairs, back to where Caruso is sampling some tasty poisoned uh, pasta bolognese. And once he goes off being sick, and that's when we're going to go ahead and fiber wire him too. Again, it's quite a, an easy way to go through this level fiber wire only, really. Um, you don't need to knock anyone out either, which is kind of good. But we're going to go out this way because we're going to have to unlock this door. Because it'll be faster going out, that's why we're coming hiding over here. This is, this is where Silvio Caruso comes anyway, so I'm just going to wait patiently here. And this is where I am actually going to fast forward it, I think. Yeah. So when Silvio Caruso has been poisoned, he's heading his way over here. We're going to hide in the crate because uh, we're not sure if he can see us while he's in the state. So just to, as a precaution, we're going to hide in the crate. So once he has his back turned, we can leave the crate and then pull out our fiber wire and choke the bitch. And then we're going to hide his body in the conveniently placed crate behind him. And now we've got to destroy the virus. It's a bit of a chore. This is the only thing I don't like about Sapienza. The, the targets are great. 
the map is brilliant and the atmosphere is just great. But the, the, just the problem is the Varus is kind of a bit of a... Oh, it's always a chore. Once you've gotten rid of the targets, you don't want to be going down here and taking out the Varus. No, no, one, no, one, no one wants that, man. No one cares for that stuff. People just want to get the targets and get out. We don't want to take no virus out. Damn it. But anyway, we're going to come down here anyway. Throw a coin to distract this guard. I don't really know why I did it. Don't really need to do it. You can be extra patient and then go past anyway. Because either way, we had to wait uh, for him to frig around and pick his ear. Pick the wax out of his ear. But yeah, never mind. So I'm gonna, I tried to do the glitch where you drop down with a weapon. But I didn't do it. I didn't time it properly. And instead of going back up and doing it again, I'm able to slide down the pipe. So... I'm not going to shoot from up there because I don't want to be doing all that shit now. I don't care for all the waiting because some, most of the time you'll aim from up there and trying to shoot the virus from up there and, and most of the time I'll just miss and it's pure luck really whether you get it or not. So just to take the extra uh, extra care, we're going to come down here and make sure we do actually get it. We're going to shoot the stalactite to make sure we nail it and also making sure nobody's seeing us while we're uh, trying to do it because I did try to do this in a previous run. I aimed. I shot the pistol and straight away I got spotted and it fucked up the whole run. So I have to uh, <laughs> do another recording. So that is the best place to shoot the stalactite right there. Then we can just run to the plane and we'll be finished for this uh, fiberglass special of Sapienza. And so that'll be Paris covered now, Sapienza, Bangkok, and I've got Marrakesh left to cover and the bonus episodes as well. Let's see if you do actually want to see that. If you do want to see the bonus, if you do want, sorry, if you do want to see the uh, the bonus episodes in me covering the Farbois only and possibly no knockout as well, then let me know in the comments below. Let me know what you think of this video and the the series so far. Uh, see what you tell me what you liked about it and all that kind of stuff. Yeah. So thank you very much for watching. Be sure to hit a like on this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe here if you are new to the channel. And I'll see you in the next video, guys. Cheers.